Okay, so we're back more SmackDown. Shut your mouth. June second week, two thousand and two. It's Monday Night Raw. Just failed to uh, get into the King of the Ring by losing to The Rock. It was my first loss. So back fighting the mid carders. The jury versus Jeff Hardy. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that gets us. I might go nice Flair. I was nice Flair for a title shot last week. I got put in this King of the Ring qualifier. So I think I'm just going to go to Flair now. Tell him that I want a title shot. But we'll see what happens. We'll see who's around. Anyway, there might be someone stood over there. No, not this time. So we'll go over to the VIP room. Got our run on here tonight. Oh, VIP room. Yep. So there goes Jerry approaching Rick Flair. And it's loading. Hey Jerry, what can I do for you? What do you want? I'm really busy right now. I want a title shot. Which title do you want to challenge for? Intercontinental, European. Intercontinental. Okay, let me see what I can do for the title match at the next pay for you. So can I help you with anything else? How am I doing right now? 70. You seem to be doing just fine, but don't stop there. Keep working hard. That's all. So I've got my superstar points. I can't remember what I was at before, but now I'm up to 70. Still against Jeff Hardy, let's not change that. I don't even know who the Intercontinental Champion is, but we'll have a look into that maybe in the next episode. I can't remember how you look, to be honest. Um, so we'll have to see. Oh, Undertaker looking very angry. It's Jerry coming to the ring now. I'm going to decimate Jeff Hardy to make up for my loss to The Rock last week. But to be fair, I lost to The Rock. It can't be too bad, right? Can you put your attributes up on this game? I don't think you can, but you can on Here Comes the Pain. You like have a little locker room with the attribute points. So obviously, you, I don't think you can get better on this game, but you can on uh, Here Comes the Pain. We'll tell you now, I've not played my career mode, but SmackDown Here Comes the Pain just looks far better than my career mode. Um, like, it seems like it's like the same kind of thing, but just done better like 10 years ago. If you um, go onto YouTube into the search bar and have a look at, um, I think it's called Push Square, and like the video is called Everything, Everything Wrong with WWE 2K15 or Everything Wrong with My Career Mode or something like that. Um, it kind of goes into what's wrong with it, and I think it also makes the analogy that SmackDown Here Comes the Pain just did it better, but like 10 years ago. I think I, has, I have said that in a former video before hearing that, so it's not like I've copied... Oh, Jeff Hardy going for a tumble there. It's not like I've copied uh, the guy at Push Square, but at the same time it just shows it all kind of had like the same thought. Ah, Jeff Hardy now. Going for the groin shot. That's what The Rock did. That's probably why The Rock won. But yeah, can't get complacent now, can't get my off the ball. But um, possibly got an intercontinental title shot coming up. And Rip Flair says he'll look at the next page. I don't know whether he means that, that you've got a shot or whether he means that like, he'll see how well you do. So if I'd lose to Jeff Hardy, uh, then I probably shouldn't be getting a, an intercontinental championship shot because he's the type of guy that would be the intercontinental championship at, uh, champion at this time. I don't think he'd be the intercontinental championship. That'd be quite weird. Just someone coming out wearing Jeff Hardy around their waist. Oh. So, let's move again. Repetitive arm drag move where you both do something. It makes no sense. I never liked it on wrestling games when you get the moves where like both guys would have part of the move. Because it's like, well who the hell says that Jeff Hardy would go for an arm drag in the first place, you know? Oh, the Karakamana. And when you like punch Kane in the face twice on a uh, hit of pain. That's a cool move. Yeah, when you punch Kane in the face twice and then he catches your hand and like, bends your wrist, it's just like, who says the Kane would just stand there while she punched him twice? It just doesn't make sense. Oh, Tajiri knocks out. Oh, just a two count. Lita coming to the ring. Leave it out, Lita. What? Jeff Hardy slamming Tajiri. I don't know what happened there. I you know, try to go for a move myself. Set up power bomb. 
Get out of the ring later. I'm gonna go for the pin four. Sure, inevitably break it up. Oh, maybe not. Wow, that was I just get out. Oh damn it! I was hoping I was too far for her to hit them. No, oh, I can't lose two weeks in a row. That'll just be depressing. No, what the? How did that go from standing up to me being on my back? And now Jeff has a finisher. I think he probably only has the um, Swanton Bomb, but still, if he gets up on that top rope, I've had it. Big suplex there. Oh no, he does have the twist of fate. Oh no. Tajiri is down and out. Come on, get up to Jerry. Put him in the corner. Oh, the arm drag move once more. Put him in the corner. Put him in the corner. No, apparently not. Hurricane Rana. Let's go for the pin. Pin time. One. Two. Oh, just the two. Getting desperate now. Oh, Jeff Hardy with a suplex. No, do not. What is he doing? Come on, Stewie. Stewie with the back drop. Back drop to Jeff Hardy there. Going for the pinfall by accident. Arm drag. Or oh, no, snap now, I should say. I'm doing the taunt there. Oh, what? Taunts don't give you. Uh, like. I can't remember what you call it, but the. Like. Stuff that gives you a finisher. Taunts don't give it you in this game. Uh, Irish whip into the corner. Hurricane runner off the top rope. Can to Jerry pull this one out? This is a very tense match here. Smack down. Bang! Oh my god. One, two, three. To Jerry wins. Now you've got to give him uh, an Intercontinental Championship shot. Just got to. Jerry wins. Now loading. Is anything going to happen? Or are we going into the next week? Oh, The Undertaker. Oh, The Undertaker's Intercontinental Champion, I think. God damn it. Hey, I heard you want to shot at me. You better bring your A game. I'll have a title match at the pay per view. Okay, so I've got a fight the Undertaker. Great. The Rock beats William Regal and the Undertaker and Kurt Angle beat Edge. So like, I just did got defeated by the Rock. I don't know how I'm going to defeat the Undertaker. Oh my god. So we are at Raw in the third week of June. That means it's the end of this episode. So if you like it, please do give it a like, comment on it and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time.